currently 10, 11, 12, 1, three hours away from being on stage. I am so excited. I just like, I totally just exhausted myself by posing for like 30 minutes. It was ridiculous. Like, um, I know I told you guys before, I enjoy, um, if I ever like feel down or feel like, um, you know, um, nervous or anything, I just put on everything, put on my suit, put on my jewelry and everything, curl my hair, do my makeup, obviously I have to do all that stuff anyway, um, I just do it all and then I uh, pose and I pose and I pose and you know, I just feel really, really good, I really like my body and I think that the judges will like my body and from here it's just a waiting game to see what happens. So my cheat meal yesterday, yeah, it was a cheat meal. I don't like calling it cheat meals though. Anyway, I had a burger and fries and I'm staying at Silver Sevens Hotel. Um, most bomb fucking burger and fries. It, like, it was so good. I was just like shocked out of my mind. I'm just like, um, I could possibly finish this whole thing, but I stopped myself. Um, because I didn't want to go overboard, but I was like, whoa, this is really good. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, um, yeah, so, I mean, it worked really well, because I, I was doing posing today, and I got nice and pumped, and, like, in my previous shows, I would be so freaking flat, and I would have to pump up and eat and pump up and eat and eat and eat and pump up, you know, so I won't be so flat, and a lot of people are like, well, you're bikini, aren't you, like... Um, you don't need to do that, do you? And it's like the art of bodybuilding. I mean, when you're lean and um, you are a competitor, when you're lean, there are certain things that you have to do to make your muscles pop to um, get that um, water and all of that into your muscles. And, well, you're manipulating water so that you're not getting it into your muscles, but you're manipulating your food so that you appear more full on stage as opposed to flat and when I say flat I mean like stringy watery looking muscle as opposed to hard um, defined solid muscle if you know what I mean so look at bodybuilders and you know bodybuilders will always say oh my god like I wish not all but beginners will be like man I wish that I was able to eat more before my show because I look better after my cheat meal at night well that's the reason is because um, the carb up and the fat up really fills your muscles out and you just look more full as in like muscle and so I want my muscles to be full that's a goal of mine and that's the way it's done I don't go up there to look skinny like I don't want to just look flat and skinny I freaking made muscle I built this shit I want to show it off so this morning I had my oatmeal and that's it and I got pumped doing my posing so I was like wow this is going very well like the food introduction because I thought I would have to be snacking on carbs all morning but I don't because I'm good my cheat meal is good and my oatmeal is good and now I'm just waiting until like 11 and I'm gonna have some cinnamon toast crunch um and then wait until the meeting and then I'll take my candy and some rice cakes and I'll eat that and pump up and fucking hit the stage. I'm so excited. I'm really, really excited. I psych myself out sometimes, but you know, everyone does that and I just feel confident in what I'm bringing and I know this is not the best angle in life, <laughs> but I hope you guys have enjoyed my vlog. I will not have stage video unfortunately because I don't have anyone here to support me <laughs> but so yeah but um thank you guys so much for watching and I will check back in with you I know I feel like dead I seem dead because I did posing and I'm like I'm gonna go to sleep now um yeah see you later I'll let you guys know how pre-judging goes yay
guys. It is 7 o'clock. And I just got done with prejudging. Like, bikini is still going on, but I'm class C. And the, we were supposed to go on at 1. 1 o'clock. We went on at 6. So, yeah. That was fun. Um, turns out, I got... What am I going to do? I'm going to do this. I got second callouts, which I'm happy about, but of course disappointed. So I got second callouts and dead center of second callouts. So I'm happy about that. That's great. Like once they called us out, they immediately moved me to the center, um, which means I have a chance tomorrow to break into the top. But um, yeah, so I'm just super excited and happy about it. Um, I'm just really, really hungry. And of course, if I got first callouts, I'd be like, oh my god, guys, guess what? But it was a very exhausting, exhausting day. Seeing as I only packed meals for until about three or two o'clock, you know, um, didn't plan food until seven o'clock. I'm exhausted, I'm dehydrated, I'm dead, absolutely dead. And, but, okay, so, like I said before, I would be happy with top 10. Top 10 is like my ultimate goal, especially out of how many freaking girls are in our class. I don't have an exact number, like I don't know how many there were, but there were so many. And when they pulled us all on the stage, we were all like crowded on the end of the stage and like the judges couldn't even see me it was really really shitty and I'm just like hi like look at me you know but it was it was not fun but um what I was saying is that I'm really happy with how I look I'm happy with what I brought and I could not be disappointed right now like in the slightest it's a really weird feeling because no I didn't place top five but I feel amazing, you know? I don't know why. I'm super competitive. You guys know because you've seen me do my shows. I'm competitive as fuck and I don't like losing. But I just, for some reason, I don't feel like, I, I've said before, I've, I won just by doing this show. I won. And I just feel great. I feel my body's great. And I know they're going to be like tighter glutes, tighter glutes. I know that I don't have the absolute tightest glutes okay um but they look good as fuck though like <laughs> i mean i'm happy like this is great this is this is good for me you know like i really like this but you know i know they want tighter and tighter like the girls in first callouts were tiny skinny little things like i thought that i was small like they look make me look huge but anyway i'm not gonna ramble anymore because i'm starving i need to call my boyfriend and I need to eat immediately, so thought I'd check in with you guys. I'll get back to you tomorrow. Maybe I'll break that top tomorrow. Maybe. Who knows? There's always hope. I'm always going to hope, so um, yeah, I'm going to peace out. All right, five minutes. Okay, guys, so today is Sunday, uh, the day after the show, and um, so I didn't place last night. As you guys know, I got second call out which I'm totally fine. I'm happy about. Um, it was a great show. And the judges, I don't know. <laughs> what am I saying? It was a good show. The judges did not go for my big, beautiful quads. <laughs> um, looking at myself compared to the other girls. My legs are much bigger than theirs are, and they did not go for that look. So, I'm going to try my luck at the Pittsburgh show in five weeks. I'm super excited. It was really, really great doing the show yesterday. Um, I'm happy. I placed 12th out of 49 girls, and I feel great about it. Um, I know that I'm on the right track. And I know that my body is great. I just need to tighten up my legs even more than I already have. Like more and more and more and more. And just keep on going. 
And then from there, I can just immediately step on a pro stage because I think I'm ready, like, body-wise. You know, I just keep getting leaner and leaner and leaner, and my legs just need to catch up. So, these next five weeks will be spent tightening up my legs more and more, which means more cardio, more cardio, and more cardio. I've, always, I've already been at 50 minutes a day, so I'm going to keep it at that, but I'm going to do like higher intensity, see how my shin splints work. Hopefully they don't get too bad, but I know that they will, but I don't know. We'll see what happens, and then... Um, Let's see, I'm in Vegas, I'm going to go enjoy the day, it's hot as hell, um, I'm going to brunch with my friend, and then um, with a couple friends, and then who knows what's going to happen, who knows, I'm going home tomorrow, and tomorrow's leg day, or just cardio day, there will be a lot of cardio only days, I mean, my muscles where it needs to be, I just need to maintain and like keep keep up my my gains so this is my outfit so yeah went out to eat last night and um, had dinner had dessert it was amazing and it was great but tomorrow back in the grind and I'm sorry I'm like I need coffee or something I'm dehydrated I need water but yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Um, you're the best. Watch my pro card journey. Maybe the next show it'll happen. Pittsburgh, five weeks out, very last week of August. And I'm super excited. Of course, I'll show you guys some photos right now. And um, yeah, stay tuned.